Ah, yes. <laughs> the master of puns, is she now? Oh boy. <laughs> I do like I do like puns. Okay, one. We'll, we'll do one. Uh what lies on the bottom of the ocean and twitches? A nervous wreck. Hey, look, a game. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, come on, that was good. Yeah, no, wait, okay. <laughs> Uh, nope, nope, nope. Thank you. There we go. Um, so we were trying to solve the murder of a man. Uh, he he left his wife behind with her servant, and something is not right. And I've been thinking about this. I wonder where it's saved though, because I don't know. Where did it save? Oh, right here. Okay, good. Um, we have to look around this room more. So I wanna go back. Hello. To this room for a second. No, please, Curious Cabot, no! Not Baru's Rimworld! No! Is it just as bad as mine? <laughs> Is there just as many murder? Um, so I was thinking about this yesterday. And we have... There's two things I was wondering. So we have this rope. Uh, the bell rope. I was wondering why that was cut. But then I thought... She was tied to, his, to this chair. Uh, the lady of the house was tied to this chair. And I think... That was that rope. Uh, but it was cut quite high up, and I'm, I wonder what's the significance of that. It's worse, Curse Cabot? Oh god, please don't send me there. No! <laughs> oh boy. Well. <laughs> uh, and then there was this grate. Um, at the fireplace, which has blood on it. Now. That is a bit weird, because he was hit in the head by a poker, and fell to the ground, and then there's blood over there. But if you hit someone, wouldn't there be blood spatter somewhere else? I'm just pondering things. So why is it over there? Why is it there? That is just, that is odd. Unless he hit his head, which um, Sherlock already said. But then why is it still stead? That's a sturdy grate. So, eh. Hmm. Hey, Deimos. Hey, B-side. So, yeah. Sherlock Holmes comes home with a box of lemons. Watson asks where he got them. And Holmes replies, a lemon tree, my dear Watson. What? I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I was not. That's a very shiny floor, by the way. And I don't even have RTX. <gasps> Secret RTX. No. Cleanest floor ever. So, that is what I was wondering. Um, it's a bit of a mystery. Um, what I think I'm going to go for with my conclusions is that the ladies of the house are lying. I think they are lying. Still don't get it. <laughs> Participation. I still don't get it. Elementary. 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 Oh, there we go. Sorry, I was. <laughs> I was so focused on this. <laughs> Thank you. Now I get it. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I'm so focused on this. I've been thinking about this yesterday evening, and I fell asleep with this, so <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> so
so focused. Um, we did need to uh, look around this room a little bit more. Now, that guy over there that is dead, we're not very sad about that because he was beating, beating her and he was an angry drunk. And uh, according to his doctor, he was dying anyway because he was drinking way too much and his liver was, well, shot. Not with a gun, but you know what I mean. So, yeah. <clears throat> We examined the whole safe. We got the picture. Is there anything else that I need from this room? Oh, what a horrible thing to have happened. Please leave my Mary alone. She suffered so much. Yes, well. <sighs> oh, right, we have to get Toby. Oh, you're all just in time to get our doggo. Yay. Did I, did I solve the mystery of the puns? Okay. <gasps> I can go into the garden. Nobody said I would... I was able to go into the garden. What? <laughs> oh, those houses. Let's take a look. Hold on. I'm so curious with this. What is this? Oh, I probably shouldn't go there yet, right? Doing it anyway. Ah, story locks. Okay. <gasps> Look at that house. I'm a dinosaur. Guess that's who. Thank you for the host. Also, hi. Look at that house. It's ugly, um, but also very pretty. It's too much though. I already said I hate the wallpaper in that house. I hate it. Okay. Oh, Toby. I need you. So I really hope we can finish this game today because <laughs> this is my last day of the week streaming. <laughs> I don't need all the time I can get. Hi, Toby. Hi. Are you coming? Are you gnawing on my shoe again? Oh, you silly, silly boy. Okay, come on. Come on, Toby. We need the best nose in the British Empire on this case. He is so cute. Are you coming? I agree with you, Toby, that Watson's shoe is preferable to Mrs. Hudson's cold cuts. Oh, it's Watson's shoe. Oh, that's even better. Yes, I did adore you. Yes, you were adorable. Yes, you were. Yes, you were. <clears throat> um, can we just go? Can we just... Yeah? Huh? Oh, uh, there's the desu. Oh, there we go. There's the doggo. I think Maya is very lucky to have you. Hey, Crispy. Okay. Let's put this dog to work. Search, Toby. Yes, yeah, search. Go on. Oh, we're the dog now. That's the best part. In uh, A Devil's Daughter, you get to be Toby as well at some point. And it is great. Bork! Bork! <coughs> awesome! My... Boss guy is the best. Yung. I smell a smell. <laughs> oh, yes. <sighs> this way. This way. I knew it. This way. Huh? More smell? Hold on. Bark, bark. The intruders entered the shed for some reason when they were making off with the silverware. Did they hit it in there? Hold on, I wasn't done yet. Hi. I have more smell. There's some smell over here. Where is this going? Huh. Uh. Can you smell it, Chad? Can you smell it? It lies in the seat. It is. 
Ooh. Bark, bark. This way. Human. Right here. The scent leads to the well. I should check it. I love you. Now to find a bone. Oh, wait. I smell something else. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. Sniff, sniff. Bork, bork. The intruder's trail is lost behind this wall. The criminals left the house through the French window. They walked to the shed, then across to the well, before fleeing by climbing over the wall. I wonder why they chose such a winding route. I don't know either. Where's my doggo? Hi, Toby! Brave Toby. The best nose in the British Empire. Yes. You deserve a cookie or five. Hey, Selman, you're late. Well, just a little bit. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. You only missed the dog part. <laughs> it was adorable. Good doggo. Indeed. What's in the shed? What secrets lie beyond there? Ooh, what's that? That version. Oh, that's a lovely spot. Look at this. Sorry. <laughs> Oh, hello. What is this? A hook? This hook might be useful. Take it. It's yours now. Small gardening tools. Nothing of great interest. Bags of seed. Some empty bags were recently moved. Okay. Interesting. Anything else? Ooh, treasure! This old suitcase sounds hollow. It must be empty. Oh, no treasure. Boo. Da -da -de. Always look for treasure. So, hmm? Is that blood? Or is it just shadows on the bucket? It's probably just shadows, but still. Suspicious. <gasps> what is this? There's something glittering at the bottom there. But how can I reach it? I have a hook. <laughs> hey, Nevermore. Uh, what? <laughs> what? If only I had something with which I could lift that object. Oh, I have, I have, uh, If only I had something. No, wait, oh, this, uh, there we go. Good I? Oh, that's what you want. Okay, no worries. Wow, I wish everything was that easy. <laughs> oh, what is this? Silverware. This is hardly a coincidence. Well, well, well. Wow, that is some... The Brackenstall coat of arms. It appears that we have found the stolen silverware. Huh. Insurance straws? No. <laughs> no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, that's okay. Participation award. I keep forgetting your name. I'm so sorry. Um, <laughs> I should call you PA. <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid with all your friends. And I love having you guys here. And you go are probably to sleep right now, aren't you? <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Till next time. Yes. Ha! Or... Yar!
<laughs> I will find you. I have good spy friends. Chat is full of them. Uh, robbery is the motive. Robbery is confirmed as the motive for the crime. The criminals may have plans to return for the silverware that they have jumped or imitated robbery. The robbery could have been imitated to explain Sir Eustace's death. The silverware was not supposed to be found. This one. What if... What if... The murder was not a murder. What if the murder was an accident? And they made it look like a robbery. It's very elaborate and unnecessary, but that could be a thing. That's not... No. Okay. Well... Let's talk to the ladies in question. I have questions. Ta -da 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 -da. Road you, that was it. Thank you, Jonesy. I'm so bad with names. Terrible. Hi, I found something. <laughs> hey, your silverware has been found. Surprise! <laughs> we found your silverware, Lady Brackenstall. It had not been taken very far. Is that true? I am very thankful to you, Mr. Holmes. Your ladyship? Yeah, either they did it together or she did it. To protect the lady of the house. We found your mistress's silverware. Oh, that's good news. You really are as clever as they say. <laughs> Maybe too Indeed. clever. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yes. Well. Where's Watson? Watson? Where have you gone? Home? A fur trader's cabin. A hunter seen. The Brackenstall family appear to be preoccupied with hunting. Mm -hmm. Oh, I will check, tell the inspector. I will. I was just wondering if I missed something. Right here. Shall we? Hmm. Inspector, I have recovered the stolen silverware. Ta -da. You are a wizard, Mr. Holmes. And where is it? In the garden well. Excuse me? Unique, isn't it? <laughs> Rather absurd. What is the point of stealing silverware and then throwing it down into a well? Perhaps it was used as a temporary hiding place. Or simply the thieves wanted to get rid of it. It is up to us to solve this mystery. What do you know about Sir Eustace, Inspector? What was his reputation? A charming man when sober, but an absolute demon when he was drunk. In such moments, he was apparently capable of anything. Why, once he splashed fuel on Lady Brackenstall's dog and set it alight. What? Another day, he threw a decanter of wine at Miss Wright's head. Hmm, the alcohol seemed to madden him. What? To the point that we were forced to intervene several times to avoid a scandal. Oh, well, I am not sad. He is dead. Set a dog on fire? Are you mad? Send him to the Shadow Realm. I will. I will kill him again. You, you, you. Evil. That is not okay. What are you doing there now? <laughs> Excuse me. Holmes, don't look at me like that. 
I don't know what to think about all this. But I do. It was a devious plan. Oh, what a horrible thing to... Please... Okay, I'm missing something. La -da 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 -da. Do I have something? Ah, I have to perform analysis on the rope. Of course. Um, ba -ba, da -da -da. Big shit. I should have done that before. I forgot. So it's okay to set a cat on fire instead? Uh, no, Blue Wolf. We don't set animals on fire. No. Mm -mm. No. Absolution for the murderer? I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Oh, yes. That's not okay. I, I. It's still murder, and that's not okay, but it's. It gets more understandable <laughs> every time we hear Let about us that see guy. How the rope was cut. The fibers at the end of the rope are smoothly cut. So it's a sharp object. Let us try to find out what tool was used to cut the rope. I would say scissors. The fibers from this cut appear to be different. Oh, well, fine. If I cut the rope with a knife, it matches the original. Okay. Erectus don't count? Yes, they do. We don't set animals on fire. Point. Period. No. The rope was cut once with a sharp knife and tied quickly in a sailor's knot. That could indicate that the intruder has a sailor's background. That is the only thing that is weird about this case. That's the only thing. There was a sailor's knot and now we find out that it was um, also there was also a knife used and in the case of the ladies I would say they'd rather use scissors. But I don't know. Hey Mac! So there is someone involved that has knowledge of sailing or boating or whatever you might call it <sighs> murderous visitor so your sister was murdered by the one person who was visiting that night it was he who tied up lady bracken's stall. he is tall and strong I can go with that. I mean, either the ladies did it, or they did have a visitor. Well, sailor suspect, eh? That is a problem. Um, well, I guess we have to talk to the lady again. Can't go anywhere else. Blood wolf, really? Oh, well, I have to say, I, I'm not a fan of scorpions or spiders. <laughs> oh God! Hi, I have questions. Oh, what a heart! Never mind. Hi, I have questions. Please. Ah, uh, why does nobody want to answer my questions? Where do I go for sailors? 
What's that? Hi. Holmes, don't look at me. Okay. Um. Does Watson know more? I have. I have no. I don't know. I have no. What should we do next, Holmes? Well, apparently we have to find sailors, but I have no clue where. <laughs> and uh, I can't yell for the boy outside. So maybe this lady can help. Yoo-hoo! Hi, do you know any sailors? Are you, are you acquainted with any... Oh. I don't think she wants to help. That's not true, Sarai. We do have venomous things in, in Europe, but um, they're either too small <laughs> uh, or um, not that common. It's not that common. Mm. Hey, Oggs! Hi! Okay, so what do I have and what do I need to do? <sighs> Where's my evidence? <laughs> Search for possible sailor suspects. Where? You need to move to Europe? Yes, you do. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I found that funny. Yes, you do. Maybe I can... There's nothing I can do... Unless I have to look on the map, but... Sorry, I have some problems figuring out where I have to go from here. The game tells you what, the game tells you what to do? Yes, I know! Search for possible sailor suspects. But where? I mean... <laughs> I don't know where. What am I missing then? Not there. Oh, not here. I Well, I would guess not here. Let me look at the map in, um, in my home. That's the only thing I can think of right now. That's where the tab is. Okay, well, I'll, I'll figure it out. Don't you worry. I'll figure it out. Ugh. 